Jacoby didn't come this morning. You know what somebody told me? They said, you know, I got to get Jacoby to talk. And I said, if anybody gets Jacoby to talk, I get him to talk. Mm -hmm. How you doing, pal? You got a bunch of minnows there? We got your minnows that took tr forever to get. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah. We're going to trade each minnow for a big crappie and fillet it. Does that sound like a winner? Yeah. You feel pretty good about going fishing with me and, uh, and being able to keep the fish? Knowing that you can keep the fish? Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Big, giant crappie we throw back. Yeah, but the good eating size crappie. The throwback little ones and great big ones. We're gonna catch middle sized ones. Okay. Yeah, that's right. See, if, if somebody ate people, like cannibals, they'd throw you back. They'd, they'd throw me back too, because I'd be too old and tough. <laughs> they'd, eat, they'd eat your dad. <laughs> well, I don't know if they'd do that or not. <laughs> I don't know if they would or not. They'd probably throw you back too. <laughs> well, let's go catch them. McPhil, these are not bobbers, they're not corks, they're floats, they're floats. And this is a neat deal right here. I'd never seen these, I wasn't totally sure exactly how to hook them up. But all you do is you bend, pull that rubber up and then hook your, I mean that spring up, and then hook your hook your line in the little knots there. I didn't quite get it in there. It almost, that's a pretty powerful little spring. That little spring up and then just, just hook, the, hook the line in that little slot down there and then once you're set that's all it's just a little slot once it's in that little slot it's set and then you get you can move it easily move to different depths and i've got that at that depth right there i'm fixing to put a minnow on there and see what happens it's about i got that about five foot probably there he is there he is An another bluegill oh mine's way bigger another, than yours oh yeah it's way bigger than that one the bluegill out of those minnows bluegill and bass Guys, we're supposed to be crappie fishing. So far, we're catching everything but. Everything but a crappie. But we're catching fish. That's the main thing. Yeah. Hey, he got this through two parts of his lip. He's swimming around in there. He might I mean, survive. You got, you got him doubled up. You got him double lipped. Look. Put your hand around them like that. All right, take that hook out. It was just stuck. Which switch turns on the aerator? Uh, one says aerator. Lots, horns. <laughs> That's the <laughs> only way, Dad. <laughs> That's a nice big pretty bluegill. Here we go. And everything? Crappie? That might be a bass. We that feels like a bass. Turn. He's Holy moly. He's <laughs> get him up here. Houston. Look at here. Can I get him? Oh, it's yeah, a big bass. It's oh a big bass. I made a big one. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> get him Look up there. I knew that would happen. <laughs> I knew oh. that would happen. Big Let me old have bass. That fish. Let me have him. Try, try to take my fish. <laughs> yeah. Who do you think you are? <laughs> That's a good one right there. I believe I had a crappie right here a minute ago. We're gonna, Let me we're gonna see. probably. No, don't give me the hook. We're probably gonna catch. Oh, thank you, Houston. I appreciate you. Oh man, that's a beauty. Look oh, at that. Goodness. That's a big bass that right there. Bass. I got. Hey, something. Houston. I we still a have a deal. goal for you this year to catch a five-pound bass, if you remember. Well, this ain't a five-pounder, but I'd sure like to see you catch a five-pounder on his little cane pole here. There we go. That's a crappie. That's not a very big crappie, but I think he's big enough to eat. What do you think? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. He's pretty small. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, we have to throw this one back. Hey, guys and girls, we've got something really kind of fun and special. Something I haven't done in a long, long time is fishing with minnows with a cane pole. Actually, a modern cane pole. It's one of the Jimmy Houston telescopic rods. They only are uh, telescopic poles, three or four piece. They only, hey. there's, look at that little tiny crappie. <laughs> Now, mine, mine looks maybe big enough to keep after that. What do you think, Houston? Uh, yeah. Yours is definitely a lot bigger than that. <laughs> <laughs> I got my buddy Daniel Arms from Arms Family Homestead in, in, in Houston, my little fishing buddy. Houston, well, are you eight or nine now, Houston? Um, I'm, I'm eight, but I'm going to turn nine in August. I, I knew you were getting really, really close. i tell you what. What do you think? What do you think, Houston? Keep him or throw him back? Uh, throw him. Throw him back. That's we'll do that. 
Houston doesn't say that very often. He doesn't say that very <laughs> often, does he? I guarantee you. We got us a bucket of minnows, and now we may have to end up putting some soft plastic on because we probably will catch a lot of bluegill. We'll probably catch a lot of bass. We may run out of minnows and not have enough crappie. We're going to do a catch, clean, and cook. We're doing this for our YouTube channel as well as Daniel's YouTube channel, Arms Family Homestead. Daniel's got about a half a million people, over a half a million people on there. Great family channel and a great arm, a home, homestead channel and a great ranch channel. Just, a, just a, they, they have a lot of fun and they, they, they do a little fishing. Houston does a lot of fishing, but they do a lot of everything else. So go over there, show them a little love, uh, sign up and, and subscribe to that Arms Family Homestead channel. I promise you, it's a you. fun channel. No, 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 it doesn't cost <laughs> anything. Yeah, that's one thing. You know, on YouTube, and a lot of people get confused because when you say subscribe, and we've got about a little over 100,000 people on our YouTube channel, 600,000 on Facebook. But when you see the word subscribe, you think you have to pay for it, like subscribing to a magazine or something. YouTube's absolutely free. You go over there and hit that subscribe button, and you're in, and you're in. Every time they hit the little bell, every time anybody posts a video that the channel that you're on, your phone will ding and you can go in there and watch your video. And we're trying to catch enough crappie for lunch. So far, we Not have well. no crappie in the pan. <laughs> but we do have two bass. We put a bass in there. One a bass, bass and a bluegill. And a big blue. Well, here's something. Oh, this feels heavy. This feels really heavy. This might be a big bass. Look at look at that. Look at that. Look at look at that guy go. Oh! <laughs> Look at that, look at that. Woo! It's gonna be a big bass. It's gonna be a big bass, sure as the world. Look at the size of that bass. Watch your pull. Look at the size of that bass, holy cow. Holy cow, look at the size of that bass on a telescopic pole. Look at that critter. Look at that critter. What do you think about that one, Houston? You gonna get it? You gonna get it for me? what I'm talking about. That's a big bass. You can see the way these poles fight a oh. fish. I mean, they, they, they fight the fish so well. Looky oh. there, Houston. Oh oh. Five pounder. Oh. <laughs> Houston. <laughs> Houston, hey. Houston, you got your a pole fish. pole in the water, buddy. <laughs> your pole, your pole went in. Here, I'll flip him up here for you. Uh, we can keep the small one. There's, oh, okay, all right, there it is. Hold, hold your fish up there beside my fish. See, that's my fish. He's interested in holding his fish. Uh, you're not going to hold your, you're going to eat your fish, aren't you? Yeah. Hey, Let's we can play that. that. Thing. Yours is the play side. Mine is the kissing size. i tell you what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm going to let you kiss my girl. You kissed my girl without permission, didn't you? There you go. Here you go. Here you go. All right, buddy. Hang on, turn, hang on. Hang turn on. her back. Woo! Way to go. Poe was taking off. It was leaving. I looked down, it was leaving. I mean leaving. It was already gone. It was in the water. <laughs> you can put that one in the live well. That's a perfect size to fillet right there. Yeah. That's a perfect size to fillet. Golly, that was fun. Holy cow, that was fun. I'll tell you what I did, I put 20 pound test line on these. Another, another I got one. another one. Oh my God. Look at that pole bin, look at that pole bin. Look at that pole. I got a 14 foot pole. I put 20 pound test line on, on these on, uh, high here. seas line on because I thought we might catch a big bass or two. Houston, I think this is another one that can go in the box. Our crappie, our crappie catch, clean, and cook might be a, a small bass catch, clean, and cook. I'm going to tell you, Houston's a pretty good hand. Let's get them fish. Put this thumb yeah, I'm, in better, his... I'm better than I was last time. Well, you sure are. <laughs> get your hand in their mouth and unhook them. Only thing better is you can put a minnow on for me. All right, we got a few bass in there anyway. It's the strangest looking crappie catch, clean, and cook I've ever seen here. <laughs> yeah. You like me to hold it's the camera? Big old crappie. There's a the crappie. There's a the crappie. Oh, catch and release. You see that? I didn't you even put my camera him, down. You released him in the boat, though. That's a good thing. <laughs> Someone hold on to Daniel the boat. So hey, grab that fish for me. Daniel finally did the right thing. He caught a crappie. And he released it in the boat rather than released it out there in the lake like he did that one earlier. Hold that one up. That's a perfect one. To Hold eat. him up that here. That is perfect. It's absolutely a perfect size right there. Finally, we catch a crappie. We are going to have lunch. I, I guarantee you, we're going to have. We're going to have. Put a, him in the box. We're going to have. Yeah, a, I got one. We're going to have a fish dinner. That's well, my that's bobber, dude. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to have a fish dinner no matter what. I promise you guys. We are fixing to do that. 
Oh, I got one. Oh. Crappie. 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 Get him in the boat. Get him in the boat. Yeah. Yeah. Now we got one now. too. Look at here. Now, now we're doing it. There's another. We might all just stay hung on that tree. Yeah. I think. Uh, what do you think? think? That, the tree holding us up back there's a good thing. Just, let's just stay hung on that tree right there. Holy. Get on. Be still. Be still. We got it. We got two crappie right there in one Be spot. Still. Both good eating size crappie. Yeah. What I'm talking about. Jimmy, got my power pole crappie? hung on a stump. Worked out perfectly. Triple. Where's that triple at, Jimmy? Well, I'm trying. I got my I got my float out there. This is bigger, Houston. Oh, I think they're about the same, yeah, huh? Yeah. See, they come out of the same pod. <laughs> I believe that's two peas in a pod. What do you think? I was just trying to pull it in and it just hammered it. You hammered it. Carpenter bass. Carpenter crappie. You hammered it. Where was that spot you were fishing at over here, Houston? I'm gonna see if I can get one. Um it was it was um right there. Oh yeah, over here. On that side of the boat? Sure yeah. looked like you were on this side of the boat. No, no, I wasn't. I wasn't at all. Hey Jimmy, do you want do you wanna keep this for one? You can throw it back if you want. What's that? This back. Let's see. No, we can we can keep that bass. We we'll make we'll make sure we have, we we make sure we have plenty. Plenty of bass. Oh, I there think I got a bass too. Get on oh, the edge of the grass. <laughs> Look at him bend that pole. Ooh. Holy moly! Can he bend that pole? He's in the grass. Oh, he get nope. <laughs> I got one. You got one. <laughs> I wasn't even recording. How'd I miss that? <laughs> Holy moly, everybody's a got a bass. A triple. Everybody's oh, got a bass. <laughs> what the heck? Where are you going? What are you doing? <laughs> Can you not get him in a boat, Houston? I'm everybody's got a bass. I'm tangled in mine. With this I'm getting mine out of the out of your way. Everybody's got a bass. Everybody's got a bass. That's what I'm talking about. We're just waiting on Houston to put his in the boat. I don't know if he's going to get him or not. He hadn't quite figured out how to wrestle that long pole yet. <laughs> you kind of got to get down there. I got a little bit too much line on this one. Maybe this one too. I got I to gotta kind of get down there and get a hold of the... I'm going to turn mine back. Houston has not mastered the cane pole boat flip yet. So the only way that I catch a fish is I just set it in the water and not use it. That's what minnow fishing is. That's what minnow fishing is all about. That's what just happened. I'm going to throw mine back too. I'm probably going to throw mine back too. Well, I'll tell you what. We, let's throw one of them in the live well. I'll throw mine in the live well. Open her up there, Daniel. That one's the biggest. I'll throw mine. Yeah, yours is the biggest, so we'll, we'll let oh, yours go. Those Nice bass. Nice bass. Way to go. That's a triple. Yep. A triple header. I think I might have tore my hook up. Trying to now get this is the triple right here. This is the triple. That's one reason I want to throw mine back. Uh, he's out of the water. Oh, you got a fish? Yeah. Bass or crappie? Oh, that's a bluegill. Bluegill. Holy big, boy, that's a big bluegill though, isn't it? I, I think mean, Jimmy's trying big... to grow some state record bluegill out here is what I think, Houston. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, Chris caught one here that I believe was a state record. The biggest one I've ever seen in my life. I mean, no doubt about it. Come on, there. Here, Jimmy. I mean, a giant. Fixing the to bend the hook we haven't even bend. caught one anywhere close to that big. It's, the, it's so big. It's just a monster. And I didn't even think about, well, here we go. That. Another big bluegill, not near as big as yours. That's pretty small. Some cane poles, I can promise you that. Houston, oh. what you got there, buddy? Big old bluegill. A big oh. bluegill. Come here. Come here. Still waiting on more crappie. Where are you, crappie? How many fish do we have in there? I don't know. That's a good question. Probably not enough yet. 
Well, I should just catch some more, by golly. We'll have to solve that problem. Big bluegill. Look at that. Oh, watch your line. Holy cow. Holy oh, cow. You. Golly, look at that. I, I can't hardly hold him. I can't hardly hold him. I don't know how big he is. He feels pretty big. Wait a minute, he's not dead yet. He's not tired yet. <laughs> I'm tired. He's Oh, oh my, God. my. Looky there. Look at that big bass. <laughs> Grab him there. Grab the fish. Grab the fish. Not the line. Grab him. You gotta get the line before you get the fish, don't you? Yep. Got him? Oh, oh, oh he got gosh. away. Don't let him get away. It's the biggest one of the whole day. Oh. You're gonna have to hold on get tight, him. dude. Get him, Houston. Come on, Houston, get that. Oh, oh. look at that. Woo. Biggest one yet. Look at that fish. Holy moly. Why can't I catch the big ones? Well, your pole's not in the water. <laughs> <laughs> your pole's not in the water. How about that? Whew, that tired me out. I'm glad I put 20 pound line on these Here. telescopic poles, aren't you? Yeah. Wow, look at the size of that fish. Give that one a kiss. Get next to Jimmy. Y'all take a picture together. Oh my together. goodness. Look you there. Perfect. Oh, that is a good one. Man, that's a big old fish right there. Hang on. That is a big fish. You sure do. Oh, oh a big look crappie. There. Look where that crappie was. Get him in the boat. Oh, get him in the boat. Get, get your line. Get your line. Get your line. Yay! Oh, let's go. <laughs> that is definitely a, a PB crappie for Houston. I can oh, promise you. That was too big to keep. <laughs> no, sir. You can keep that one. We oh. definitely got to keep. That's your biggest crappie. Ever? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's your PB that, crappie. That, All that, right. That's the. That's my biggest. Well, do you want to eat it or turn it? I back? don't care. I don't care. Put it in live. Well, we eat it. We, we need. We need. A, we need a few more crappie. Your mama oh, comes over. Your mama comes over. We want to make sure she's got plenty of fish to eat. Is she, she a big fish me. eater? Oh yeah. That's good. Hold that sucker up. Let's we see. want to have plenty. A small bass. Hold him out here where I can see him. That is a big one. Yeah. That's that a is good a big crappie. crappie. Hang on. Hold him out. No, that hold is him a out. big crappie. It's just a little crappie, nothing big deal, right? No big deal. It's my baby. It's a big crappie, buddy. That is a big. Crappie. What are you gonna do with him? Eat him. You're gonna eat him. All right. Well, put him in the box. How many fish we have in the box? Uh, I think that's 14 now. Oh, oh good. Well, Pat 11. said 10 11. while ago. 11. 11. That's 11. Is it crappie or bass? That's a bass. I thought it was a crappie. I thought it was a crappie, the bass. Who needs minnows? I use plastic. So do I. I can't find my line. I keep reaching out there for it and I can't get it. There it is. Okay, what do you think, Houston? That's a skillet bass, isn't it? Yeah. That's a skillet bass. If you're going to keep bass, that is the perfect size to keep. Something under 14 inches long. Throw the bigger ones back, 14 inches and above. But a 12 inch bass is a really good eating fish and this is the kind you want to take out of lakes. Not the big ones, not the big ones. Not the itty bitty ones. Not the little bitty ones. <laughs> <laughs> While you're messing around there, I caught your fish. Did both of y'all have one? Yeah, I got one, he had oh, one. I got, I, I got it. one. His rod took off it and I got his fish. His rod took off, I got his fish. <laughs> we are hammering these fish right now, I mean, I mean, I'm talking about hammering them. And let me tell you what we've done because this is a great technique to use with these telescopic poles. We've taken, we've taken our floats off, our McPhil floats off, and, uh, and we've just put on a little curly tail, soft plastic. I left my split shot on. It's up here just about a, about a foot above the bait, and we're just, we're just tight lining, leaving it off. Now, let me tell you what we're using here, and this is amazing. This is a little Lucky Strike kit that they sell it at uh, all kinds of tackle stores, Bass Pro Shop, Cabela's, little Lucky Strike kit that uh, costs six or seven or eight bucks. I don't even know how much, but not much. It's got all of those tails. It's got some little jig heads in it. 
I'm just, whoop, just lost that one. I'm just using a, uh, I'm just using a, a hook, just a hook, number two hook. You don't even need a jig head if you want. So if you lose a jig head, it's on there. You can put a hook and a split shot on and catch so many fish. It's amazing. This is called a little tricolor kit. Is what it's called. It's 90 pieces of bait, and it's like less than 10 bucks. Less than 10 bucks. It's amazing. You can catch so many fish on that. You can feed the whole church with that one little box. Church fish fry, that sounds good, don't it? I think it's about time to go feed the church. Go big, go big, go big.